All right, guys, welcome back to some more Life is Strange. So we are just gonna start, not with the episode one. We just completed it. It was a great ending. Yeah, I got copyrights, but that's okay. So here we go. Let's start the chapter two, episode two, out of time. Let's go. Mm. Rewind will keep me clean. I still need a shower. I am so not a rebel. I always like my bed to be neat and tidy. this crazy shit going on, it is so cool having Chloe back in my life again. Like no time. Okay Max, let's hit the showers now. Let's start doing this song. Let's go. Do the oh, you're in a dome, right? Yeah. Do not forget I need those papers before tonight. Like now. Thanks, Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'll get the tests and papers to you this afternoon. I'm so on it. Consider it done. So where's your box? That's all. Oh yeah. Okay. Ow! <laughs> One quick rewind and I could stop this TP attack. Yeah, I can. Let's go. Alyssa, can you stand over there? Um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. Wow, now that was close. <laughs> Thank you, Max. Hey, okay. Nice atmospheric shot. That's Needs dusting. Okay. I'm not saying anything, but that's that's the exact scene 
That's exactly uh, I can see it. I can see it. Hey. We shouldn't be watching this. Everybody's seen it by now. What? Whatever they're watching must be hot stuff. That's, that's, that's the, yeah, that's, you truly made it. What's happening, Dana? Everything cool between you and Juliet? Oh, yeah. Thanks again for releasing me from her captivity. By the way, the best and biggest news of the day is that Trevor asked me to the Halloween shindig. That's awesome, Dana. At least we're showing our faces together in public. So you absolutely should go with us. Borrow one of my outfits and come as a cute geek couple with your bitch Warren. Uh, I'm not big on cosplay. Don't let life pass you by, Max. So, are you coming to the party or not? Get Why the fuck not? If I hate it, I can always go back to my room. That's the spirit, Max. After this, you'll be ready for a rave. It does sound like fun. Now I have to go contemplate my party future. Hey. <laughs> what? Hmm. <laughs> okay, she doesn't have to say anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's... I forgot. It's, it's a dome room. Dorm matches. That's exactly how it goes. Oh my god. Really? Hey, T. Kate is not good. I wish David would get. Hey, Kate. How are you doing? I'm here. Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. I needed that. Anytime. That guy has issues. Doesn't everybody here? By the way, Max, do you still have my copy of the October Country? Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. Please don't, 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 don't. Okay. <laughs> I, I'm sure they wouldn't, but so. What's up, Kate? School. That's it? That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Victoria, that wasn't me. Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> you're going to be sorry someday. Oh, boo-hoo. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up, and you know he has the good shit. Preach it, sister. Yup, I still have goddamn paint all over my face. Good thing my faithful minions took their sweet time bringing me a towel. We ran all the way- Give it a rest, Taylor. Now I know if I'm in an accident, I won't rely on you or Courtney for help. You can hang out with Kate, or Max. She's a weirdo with that dumb camera. I hate that I'm so quirky crap. Anyway, let's leave the link to Kate's video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You are such an evil biatch. I love it.
I better get dressed than go give back Kate's book. Hmm. Water is almost as good as a cup of strong tea when I'm in sleepy mode. Of course it is. Hello? Water? Sorry. I forgot. Is that the link to Kate's video? Damn, Victoria is so fucking mean. This is it. Even if I can stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. Did you see that back there? The right here in this wall. Just didn't. Rachel is a something that I can't say. Well, I can, but I don't want to. Victoria, can we knock? Fine, I won't disturb you. Okay. No fucking way. This is not why I came to Blackwell. And I still have to clean all this crap up after I find Kate's book. Okay. Kate's book. But as such. My desk is a pigsty, but I know it ain't there. Okay. Well, I keep my books in there, so I'm sorry. No book here. Let's think it as a student. Where would you put it? Right over here, maybe? No? Okay, over here? Nope. Let's get dressed first. Maybe I'll just put on a shirt and jeans. That's great. Hey, Einstein had the same exact suit for every day of the week. And he couldn't even rewind time. Where do you put it? <laughs> Over here, of and course. nothing here. No? Okay. Well. Not in the desk, not here. You can't search here. You did search it here, right? No book here. Or over here. Of course she just spilled soda on Kate's book. I better fix this fast. Kate needs the book and I don't want to add to her list of problems. Be gone, foul soft drink. <laughs> Aha, you sneaky book. You're mine. Okay, Kate. Now I can finally take this back to Kate before I'm late. I'm gonna look at her. Mrs. Hoyda is still out sick. Okay. I heard somebody say she has severe depression. Poor thing. Lunch, 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 lunch. Okay, 11.55 to 12. How can you have lunch for one freaking hour? I had it for like 30 minutes when I was in school. Come on. Really? 2.30 to 4. Okay, that, that makes sense. I had like 2.30, my school landed. Great. Victoria. Hmm. Okay. Okay, that's the psycho. Oops. You you texting at seven fifty six a.m. Come on. Oh shit! Now I'm getting anonymous threats. It never ends. This has to be from Nathan. Kate, you in there? Yes, I'm here. Come in, Max. Kate. 
Kate is all alone dealing with this video bullshit. I hope her mother doesn't disown her. That's bad. That's bad. Come on. Kate used to play the violin every morning. She stopped last week. Oh my god. Almost forgot what Kate looks like when she smiles. Poor Kate. She doesn't look good. Um, hey Kate, I brought your book. Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? I hate bullies. David Madsen should know better. I was hoping he would. But it's nice to see that you care about me. Kate, I actually do care. So, what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid ass. He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. Yeah, right. What about this video? And I swear I haven't watched it. I can't even watch it, Max. I won't either. Thank you, Max. You know how humiliating this is for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but... Tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have no memory of it. It doesn't sound like you. I can't see you partying with Victoria. I didn't. You have to tell me more than that. What happened at the party? Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine, and then I drank water. You swear to God, so that's not a question about I'm sure. So I think Nathan did it. Not enough to get wasted, is it? I don't get wasted. Ever. I take a sip at church, and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? Did somebody drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Of course. Of Nathan course. Prescott? Oh, shit. He was being nice for a change when he offered to help me. He's the opposite of nice. What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. Then I woke up in a room. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And, and. And? That's all I remember. I don't know what happened. I woke up outside my dorm room the next day. I didn't have any marks or bruises, but I felt gross. So who took the video of you at the party? I have no idea. Probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate, we'll figure it out. I'll check back later, okay? Thanks, Max. You can put my book here near my bag. That's sad. So, Max, can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Absolutely, Kate. Anything. I need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. Should I go to the police? <sighs> if you go to the police, um, it's, it's bad, but like, in real life. But, like, in this game, I'm sure they want me to look for the proof first and then go to the police. So, I'm gonna go do that. 
If you do that, they won't believe you. You're on video grabbing at all those guys and they'll use that against you. Bad. But I know I was drugged. That's what you have to prove, not them. I'm just telling you how the cops in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. No, no, Kate. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? I, I think we should wait. There are other things going on that might help you. But not right I'm now. I'm gonna go back. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max. <laughs> Good job, Dr. Max. She didn't like what I had to say, but we need more proof of what happened. Yes, you should definitely go to the police, Kate. I totally believe every word you say. Nathan Prescott is truly dangerous. Bless you, Max. I will go to the police, and also Principal Wells. With you as my backup witness, they'll have to take us seriously now. Backup witness? Well, I mean, I believe you in everything, but we're still just spoiled punk students to the cops and faculty. I just think we need to be very careful here. Why? Careful of what? Nothing, except the Prescotts are a powerful family. I hope this won't backfire on us, that's all. Even though that rich bastard has earned some serious bad karma. He'll get it. Time out, Max. You actually told Kate to go to the police and the principal. After getting a scary text threat. Now the police will definitely drag you into this shit. Well, I'm ready for that. Okay, now what? Go back to my room. Oh. Okay, coming, 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 coming. 